All right, y'all, here's part two to the first video I just posted, 10 Maxims of Law. Got cut off. Video was too long, of course, but I'm going to leave y'all with the second part of it. He who leaves the field of battle first does not respond to the affidavit, loses by default. See that, Matthews 10, 22. He who does not repel a wrong when he can, occasions it. Sacrifice is the measure of credibility. He who bears the burden ought to derive the benefit. One who is not damaged, put at rest, or willing to swear an oath on his commercial liability for the truth of his statements and the legitimacy of his actions has no basis to assert charges or claim and forfeits all credibility and right to authority. A, a lien or claim can be satisfied only through a rebuttal by counter affidavit, point by point, resolution by a jury, or payment or performance of the claim. Genesis 2, 3, Matthew 4, Revelations. If the plaintiff fails to prove his case, the defendant is absolved. So if you're sitting in affidavits and they're not responding to them, you win. Must be rebutted point by point. Because truth is sovereign in commerce and everyone is responsible for propagating the truth and all their speaking, writing and acting, all commercial processes, functions by affidavit certified under the oath to be true, correct, not misleading and complete on each affiant's commercial liability regard all matters stated and likewise demanded and written matters on nearly every document that those who run the system's desire that you sign your signature is presumed to be under penalty of perjury. In the court setting, however, testimony and or commercial affidavit is sworn to be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help me God. The, particip the participant must provide material evidence, ledgering, bookkeeping, Proven that each fact or entry is true, valid, verifiable, and relevant. Without the acceptance of liability and support of one's assertions, no credibility is established. There you have it, people.